spills free. Chance for Allen. Chips it on the left. Fifty-two. Well, we don't have a. It's Bastanak. Yep. The mud rule earlier. Yep. Put the fifty-two on. Yep. So there's been a change. So the skipper of uh, Dandenong is now wearing fifty-two. As uh, there's a couple of changes, but more importantly, a chance for Dandenong to kick a goal. Twenty-two point margin. We're just over twenty-one minutes gone in this first quarter. And eventually, the man wearing fifty-two, he's got to carry an extra forty-nine. For the remainder of the match, and it's Bastinac, promising young man. 20 metres out, shouldn't miss, and doesn't, keeps his side in touch. Yeah, been an important player for them right throughout the year. He's uh, averaged 22 disposals a game, that's his 18th goal for the year, so he can play well as a, uh, an inside midfielder, he can play well as a medium forward. We've even seen him come. So set to go for the second quarter, it's a 20 point lead for Calder. Flipping it over the top, beautifully done was Casbol. He got it off, and now the long kick that was Bastanak forward. We're back in the middle, and Bastanak gives it to Parker. Andrews was involved as well. Spoil came up. Andrews, two on one situation, probably not the best choice. Long hands over the top. Lucent had nowhere to go there. He's eligible in his draft year, so he turns 18 next year, eligible for the draft. They can then, uh, could then, if he wished, sign, and then there's a bidding system, yeah. fair value system that comes in with the... Have forgotten to go for the footy? Yeah, a few that have just been uh, focusing on him, but their tackling skill has really improved at this level. Bastanak again, very good out of the middle. Jeez, oh. mark that. Yes. Miles Pitt. Yeah, he'll be just on his distance, I reckon. Points. The Stingrays trail. Big Casbolt. How's that knocked down to? That's the the, the best in that combination that we saw in that second quarter, which worked so well. Good tackling up forward. They might get it back here. They have. Patron and play 61. Casbolt was looking for everybody down in front, but Liberatorio there first. Somehow it comes out to Jake Melksham. He's a Mitchell. Hits it low. It's it fast. Hicks couldn't take it. Callahan. Back to Batchelor. Little chip pass. In the end, it worked. Best the next kick. Asked a fair bit of Millard. Spoil was a good one, but Millard's got it back. Squeezed the kick out. That was Gent. Pitt. Been dangerous up forward. And he's not going to get anything happening right here. Quiet time on the scoreboard at the moment. It's a really important time of the game. Is that we're going to a goal now to Cal, to Calder, for example? We'll put the margin over 30, probably the first time of the day. Over five goals, match. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 one exception I can think of. Not name, too many. Couldn't name too many more that was as proficient on both sides. Bastonac looks pretty good on both sides to me as he kicks it. Trelaw stayed in the contest. And again, just burrowed through and kept it going forward. Well, and the paddle better. again. This is good play because it's going in the right direction. Oh. The cross was a sensor. Under there by Hine into here's the middle. Now here's a go. The turnover. And it's with Bastinac. He did enough. Well. He did enough. Now to Gent. Gent keeps it low, stays right. Campbell didn't make it, but somehow it ends up with Andrews on the left boot to the goal square. In best position was Hine, away from Bastinac, and pulled out of bounds. Well, Taylor Hine is another one of those Gold Coast boys who's going to the draft camp. Yeah, he is, yes. Uh, and a dashing player. Had a very, very good year for the call to Cannon. I was a result of a game like this at a big stage. Well, still side bottom, I reckon, went from mid-teens yep. to 10 yep. last year in the back of the best game of junior football I've ever seen. Yep. Well, Bastinac has to get involved, and he did early. And there's that. There's the clearing kick. Chance for Bastinac. He's got one option and one option only. The pick up then by Bastinac. Yeah. 
It's Parker. Made it, made, made it again, press to you there, so we reload and go back to where we just came from. And same result. Turnover. Well, the stretch was on there for Bastinac. Now he hits that left foot again. Spills towards the back. Parker could get there first for Dandenong. Could yeah, that's where I think the, the Murray Bush Rangers, and although we saw them in the flag last year, and even Geelong for, to a certain extent, North Ballarat. Yeah. They got dragging in players from all over the you know their area, which is a long way. Not sure where to go. Out wider. Now some time for Shaw. Hits into the pocket. Still going. Bastinac, tight. Very tight. Screws it around the corner. Doesn't go far enough. Unfortunately for him, it hits the post. Well, that was risky play through the middle of the ground, but it was what's needed now. Mm. You know, the handballs, the knock-ons, all that sort of stuff. If you're going to win a game when you're halfway through the last quarter and you're trial by... Oh. That was terrific play by Pitt. Mm. Good pick-up. Wonderful pick-up by Baston. Oh. And just got rid of his, his opponent. Then hits the top of the square. They stand, they wait, they arrive. Parker came through, chopping the arms. From the clearance, Bastinac. Give over the top. Mitchell 